what is going on Aquarius of course my lovelies hey 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 it is Scorpion Red Tarot I am back at it I am here to, to let you know what is going on for the month of February I am so sorry for the delay you guys as you guys know I was sick with the flu so I am back and let's jump it off with you my dears okay so if anyone would like a personal and private reading, y'all can go ahead and skip on over to that About tab on my um, YouTube page. There's a hyperlink that says uh, Scorpion Reds Tarot as Simply Book Me. Again, it's Scorpion Reds Tarot as Simply Book Me, all right, if you would like to book a personal and private reading. If um, this video resonated with you and if you would like to give a love donation or a page offering, as you can see, we have all new decks here. I have a camcorder now. Thanks so much to you guys' love and support. So um, all of the money that I've been getting has been going right back into my page and um, I thank you guys so much for all of the love and support. So if you would like to give a, 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 a love donation or page offering um, my PayPal information is in the description all right let's get into the prayer alrighty father God thank you so much for bringing us here for the side of Aquarius I am feeling light full and free as you know it is Aquarius season right now shout out to all my Aquariuses um, everyone is having a birthday right now during this season y'all go ahead and show up and show out it is the season for a reason yes indeed Father God please give the sign of Aquarius some love and light during their birthday season um Thank you so much for bringing us happiness and joy and fulfillment during this time of celebration. And just thank you so much for being present in our life and um, every day and every way. Thank you so much, Father God, for all of the blessings and lessons that you've given us in the past, present, and future. Please give us guidance for the sign of Aquarius. Thank you so much, Father. All righty. Aquarius, let's get into this. All right. Please give me guidance for the sign of Aquarius. Thank you so much. Thank you for being present in this reading. Please give Aquarius guidance. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. That's a lot. I guess. Mm -hmm. Alright. So this is the Eight of Pentacles. Aquarius, y'all are in a point in y'all life where y'all are like working on yourself like to the point where it's like almost sweetheart, it's almost to a point of refinement and mastery, honey, but you done did. Boo, I don't know who you thought who I don't know who they thought you thought you was, but honey. I create mastery, honey. I create refinery, boo. I don't know what you thought. <laughs> you better re-educate yourself. You were what? What? what, what? You tell him you better educate yourself, honey. I'm just sitting over here on some Queen of Pentacles type of shit. Okay? Why you think I be so unbothered, honey? I be involved because listen, I'm sitting pretty and I work hard as shit out here to create this abundance and this lap of luxury for me. Okay? So, yes, you know, I have been on some other shit right now. And that's why I be unbothered by y'all hoes, okay? You know? Listen. You see? <laughs> Look, this is a goddamn a little, a little a leprechaun. A little leprechaun then jumped up in my inbox and said, Hey, bitch, guess what? I got some more money coming for you. So, um, yeah, why don't you come on and follow me to this other side of this here rainbow? You got little magical leprechauns jumping out of every which way on that ass, okay? You've been getting a lot of messages about a lot of new growth and development coming towards you, Aquarius, all during your season for a reason. Girl, girl, it is your world. Who this little ass man? Y'all, is y'all out here dating um, little people? Is y'all dating little people? I think little people are cute. Look at that little man. Look at that little ass man. Look at that little ass man. Ain't he cute? Aquarius. Aquarius. Aquarius, you is you in the little man's? Little man's in them. Girl, Aquarius. Look at him. Look. His little boots. His little boots. Y'all look at his little boots. Y'all, he is too cute. <laughs> I only 
thing is, only thing about his little cute ass is his little cute ass took a long ass goddamn time. You understand? A long ass time to come in, you know, drop a coin, a proper dropper, all up in our little messenger box to let us know what's your popping. You know, he, you know, he just be taking a long ass time. And throughout that time, a bitch done got a motherfucking heart broke. You understand? A bitch done got taken advantage of. You know what I'm saying? Bitch was out here fucking with old ass niggas and shit like that. Trying to act like they was the emperors and shit. Being all motherfucking controlling and shit. You know, I done had the motherfucking rush through like round round like a dungeon, like a dungeon dragon. I had to motherfucking chop that nigga down in his face like ha! I had to fucking chop the fuck out that nigga and let him know they can, you ain't cool. Who the fuck you think you talking to? You ain't controlling shit around here. Don't be, don't be talking to me with all that bass all up in your chest and be all aggressive and try and be abusive and shit. Who the fuck you think you is, nigga? Well, who you think, nigga? Don't you know I will motherfucking, I will get my kids and I will pack my shit up and I will go the fuck on home and I will leave all of that. That will leave you in the past, my nigga. What? What? Nigga. So, like, Aquarius is just like, nigga, you know, to, you know, I'm at this state of refinery and, and, it's, and it's luxuriousness and I'm luxuriating right now because I done been through all of this shit like you you why you like little man why you took so 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 long with your little ass your little dumpling little squirtle looking ass to bring your little I, I mean I'm only imagine it probably took you a little bit to get up on that horse then cause you a little bit small so you know small things maybe it take a little bit of time respect respect but I'm just saying, all that time you done took to come to me, you know what I'm saying? A, a bitch done got a heart broke. Look, I done got my heart broke. A motherfucker done came and stole from me and shit like that. Look, out here, look, I'm out here trying to date older niggas and think, you know, thinking they got their shit together and stuff. And the whole time, these old niggas come with a lot of older ass problems and shit. They controlling and they and they abusive. And they abusives. And they abusive. And my ass almost ended up on snap. So that's why I'm trying to tell you, little short man. Little short man. I went through a lot for me to have to come on back home and to work on myself to this place of refineries. To this refinerizations. And this hip hop hoary. Okay? Let's get it crunk a little bit up in this up in this jam or read. In this hip hop or read. Okay? And it took me a minute. It, and it took me. You don't, you don't understand what I'm saying, little man. Little man with the little plan. Look, little man with the little plan. Can you tell me what the fuck your little ass plan is? Because, um, I like the way all these coins is popping off. All up. I, I, I like, I like all this, little man. And I want this to continue to come on. So you, 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 you hurry your little ass up. Your little dumpling, squirtle, dirtle ass. You hurry your little slow the fuck ass on. You just come, you you just come the fuck on and stop taking so fucking long. Short ass, little boots. If you took that fucking heel off their boots, trying to be cute out here, but you y'all's out here messing around with a little short man. And he and he is the cuteness. He is the cute fucking ass. He's like it's okay, boo. You ain't got to worry about all this heartbreaking shit. That shit is in the past, boo. That is in the past, okay? Mm-mm. That is in the past, beloved. Mm-mm. He was like, he was out there fucking with an older man. Ew. <laughs> oh, oh, don't be popping off on me like that. Spirit, please give me some guidance for the sign of Aquarius and love. What is going on with this little man? Who is this little man? Or is this somebody at y'all job that's giving y'all a new job offer or something like that? I definitely, I mean, it's a lot of money coming to you. Yeah, I definitely see a new job offer coming to Aquarius for sure, for real. Mm-hmm. Maybe a little short-ass boss is finally coming to his um senses and like, let me go ahead and give Aquarius this damn, this damn raise. What is this? A fresh start. Yes, you about to have a fresh start with this little squirtle dirtle man. 
Little Squirtle Dirtle. I need to stop saying that. Why y'all? Why y'all playing with me like this? Why was that little ass man on that car? Jesus knew if I'd have seen that little ass cute little man on that car, it would have set me off. He know how I am about little people. I fucking love little people. Metamorphosis. Oh, oh, you about to metamorph? Oh, oh, not. Oh, girl, who you about to change into? Oh, girl, you about to butterfly into the phoenix in the night, girl? What you about to met? What you about to do? What you about to do? Woo -woo? I don't metamorphosis. Ooh. Who you about to turn into? I'm about to metamorphosize on some fifth dimensional shit. Oh, what is going on with you? What the fuck? Mighty Morphin goddamn Power Ranger and shit. You mirroring something. This is real confusing. What is going to, What type of mystical my, mystics? What type of bullshit is going on with y'all on y'all birthday? Y'all better metamorphosize and y'all... Who? Y'all about to... Y'all about to turn into some... Who? Mm. Okay, hold on. Who your partner? Oh. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. The fuck? These goddamn cards be confusing the fuck out of me. Okay, listen to me. Spirit is like y'all's on some new age digital pussy shit. Like y'all on some like new dimension, like motherfucking new Power Ranger pussy patented type shit. I don't know what type of shit you on, but you on some mighty one for power pussy type of shit. And I, I I need to know which dimension and which channel I need to turn my my frequency on, cause I'm trying to metamorphosize to some. Pink Power Ranger, Power Pussy ass type shit. And I'm trying to mirror your energy on some real ass shit because, um, Aquarius, like, you doing some real shit out here. You know, you, 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 uh, set down some grass roots. Okay, you, you about to set that trend out here. You about to be in out here, Aquarius. Aquarius, you, you about to be in out here. Pink Power Ranger, Power, Platinum Pussy Power. Bitch, can I get down? How can I get into the club? I, I'm trying, look, bitch. I'm trying to get into this. But I want, I want to be a butterfly, bitch. How I get down? Aquarius, how do I get down? Aquarius, I don't hear you talking. Why you ain't saying shit, man? What you? Oh, you probably can't talk through the camera. It's okay. But I'm just saying, like, I'm trying to be on this fifth dimensional digital. Uh, I'm trying to be off this new experience, this new wave. Like, what's going on, Aquarius? Can you, like, inbox me? Inbox a G. Like, I'm trying to... Hold on. I'm trying... I'm trying Mighty Morph. I'm trying Morph. Nigga. Y'all stingy out here. I'm trying to have a plat. The platinum pussy power. I, I'm, I, I feel like honestly out here, Aquarius done went and took their ass out here. Oh, what is going on with this head? Okay, what is going on with Miss um YouTube's? Cause we ain't even about to do this. Cause y'all fucking up my vibe. Man. I was on my mighty more for Power Ranger. I don't know who the fuck y'all mirroring. I feel like Aquarius, y'all done been the fuck up on YouTube, and y'all done probably found some old Alexis K Tower pussy power ass shit. And y'all just decided, you know what? Yes, you right. I'm about to step into my pussy power. Niggas don't understand the power of this poom poom. They don't understand. And I feel like you done went out here and you done mirror. You done mirror some fucking Alexis K Tower. And, 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 and Tyler, and you done stepped into your pussy power, and you done put that shit on some fifth dimensional wavelength ass shit, and you done stepped into some inner child type of shit. You understand? You like, I'm about to rebirth myself out here, because these niggas don't even understand how these pussies got out this shit, got me motherfucking popping and percolating out here. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like, there's some new A's push out here. Do you understand? I done completely re reinvented myself. This um. This some old fresh ass 
I done be them, been them rebirth the new bitch. I done metamorphosized. I done, I done, <laughs> okay, go, go, Power Rangers, bitch, excuse me, okay? I done came into union with myself, bitch. I done been a working on myself. Go, go, Power Rangers, okay, bitch? This bitch. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm dead ass serious. I feel like one, yeah. What is going on with all of this? Yeah, okay, let me tell you what. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you why they done came into their, 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 their um, goddamn place of this metamorphosis. Because you know what? They don't realize that, they realize what true unionship is and what a true union is. Okay? And I felt like Aquarius they went through, I already told you, they went through a heartbreak right here, up here. And they might still be dealing with, you know, healing from a heartbreak. Because they don't finally took them swords out of their heart. They don't threw them down and they don't put a, a bandage over it. Do you see what I'm saying? They have taken the, the blades out of their heart. And they realized what true union is. And they realized that they were being taken advantage of. And they were in a controlling, abusive situation. And it was time for them to go back home. And to stop trying to, you know, hold on to this situation with this person here. This person that broke their heart. And that had them in this third party situation that they were being taken advantage of and they forgive this person they finally got to a point where they were able to forgive this person and move on they realized that this situation was a karmic partner and it was a lesson and it was a lesson and now after all of this hard work that they have finally put into themselves in creating the mastery in the refinery where they now sit here, the Queen of Pentacles on their throne, strong. Now this little man is finally coming through with a message and they're not surprised about it. They're not surprised about it at all because they had to forgive this karmic partner, this person that was being controlling, this person that was cheating on them and did all of this stuff. They had to forgive this karmic partner in order for them to move on you know and now they're in a place of solitude and they're by their self and Aquarius actually likes being by their self at this point because they'd rather be by their self than to be in a third party situation do you see what I'm saying they'd rather be by their self than, than to be in a situation with somebody where they're going to be a third And I feel like right now, like I said, they are mirroring this person that had them in that third party situation. They are mirroring their energy because they, they're they like, okay, you want to be over there. You want to be in this situation and good. I'm going to do me. I'm going to do me, you know, and I'm just going to, you know, start this fresh start. And I'm just going to metamorphosize into something that you've never seen before. Something that you've never seen before. Because I was too good for you anyway. Because I'm a person that I... I create mastery. I create mastery. I know who I am. And I honestly feel like, you know, Aquarius... You you lowered yourself to this part to, to, to... You lowered yourself to this person. I don't care if... Yeah, this is the emperor and everything. I do feel like this person was older than you. But this person couldn't teach you anything. This person came and took advantage of you. Do you see what I'm saying? So it doesn't matter if this person fancies himself the emperor. But like at the end of the day, like you really didn't, you really didn't, you really weren't being the man that I needed you to be. You were being controlling. You were being abusive. And you were manipulating and taking advantage of the situation so at the end of the day i don't really think that that in my eyes make you an emperor at all 
So let me just go ahead and mirror your energy and be in this place of solitude because it's teaching me that I need to rebirth and regrow. And that you weren't an emperor at all. Please give the sign of Aquarius guidance. Strange Valentine. Up oh, and Valentine is coming up, you guys. Yay. So this is basically saying that, you know, a strange new love is about to come into your life. And I feel like you have a type, Aquarius. I feel like you've been attracting the same type for a minute now. And that same type has been honestly like the problem. I feel like you've been attracting the wrong type of person. And I feel like it's time to step outside your normal so that we can get different results. So let's read what this says. Strange Valentine. And it says love is strange. Okay. It says... Love doesn't always look like we thought it would. Thank goodness. Okay? It's strange and, sub and surprising. The sweetest love can be found in the oddest little pair. <laughs> and then I say a little man. Oh, you really do got a little man. Oh, that's just, I'm sorry. Like, my heart just feels so amazing right now. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Isn't it the st <laughs> I'm sorry. I really do want to cry out. It's like so beautiful. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, it's in the strange and surprising, uh, in the sweetest places that uh, love can be found, as in this odd pair have found in each other, much to each one's joy, comfort, and delight. When this loving pair, Strange Valentine, comes to visit, you're about to be gifted with love, romance, and friendship from an unexpected, even unusual place. Don't let differences keep you apart because they are what is drawing you together. And when you are delicate and fragile as you can be, someone as strong and protective as this gorgeous, friendly Yeti can be just what you need. They speak. You have an enormous amount of cosmic help at this moment, and it's all focusing on the area of your love life. You will soon receive good news regarding a relationship. You will also do a lot of work healing old wounds from your past relationship, especially past long-term serious relationships. Now, some of this news may not seem great at this time, but please give yourself a chance to absorb the lessons because you are moving into a beautiful new phase in your romantic life where you, be, where you will be free to create a wonderful new love um, life for yourself. Coming very soon, the message. You are may be experiencing a massive surge in emotional energy and new romantic beginnings so it is very likely that you'll have an it's very so it's very likely you'll attract an encounter or simply bump into someone who reawakens long lost feelings inside of you and who may not be your type hooray shit you will wake up feeling bright aware and dynamic and sometimes feeling giddy and delight this is very good news. Love is indeed strange and is wonderful. Girl, fucking love. It is your world, love. Girl, it is your world. And like I said, you're going to find you a cute little man. Ooh, of course. Aquarius. Ooh, y'all. I'm sorry. Yeah. Aquarius. Please clarify that first spread for Aquarius. <laughs> I'm 
sorry. <coughs> mm -mm. Okay, the world. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. This person wants this ongoing, ongoing saga with you, and they're not trying to tell you the truth. You know, I don't, I feel like this person in your past doesn't really want this chapter to end. And I don't really feel like you're going to find any truth and clarity in that situation with this emperor, okay? Because I don't feel like nothing else is falling out at this moment, all right? So, this person sees that you are changing the pace of the scale of where this person fits in your life you they, this person isn't fit in your life anymore you've closed that chapter and that door and do you see instead of it being a little reef it's a snake seeming like it's devouring itself you see what i'm saying so that's like a never-ending ongoing cycle okay this person is trying to delay the forward growth and you moving forward and this is like your world is moving like you might even be trying to move the distance like literally packing up your shit and you like moving moving like for real for real and i feel like this person is not trying to allow you to make that progress forward um because this is fixed energy this is like regardless if you like it or not i am moving so you can try to delay this process this progress this transition in my life if you want to. But you can honestly kiss my backside, bitch. I mean, honestly, you could kiss my backside. Because this is fixed energy. I'm doing what the fuck I want to do anyway. Straight up and down. Like that. Straight up now, tell me. Do you really want to kiss my ass forever? I, I, I. Nigga, you going to be caught in a hit and run. I don't give a fuck what you talking about. Okay? This is what Aquarius is saying. I don't give two shits a fuck what you talking about. I'm not looking for no truth out of you. I know I'm not going to get no truth out of you. And you're a fucking asshole. Dead ass. You're a fucking asshole. Okay? So this is the King of Swords. I think this is... Is this the King of Swords? This is the King of Swords, old ugly ass. And guess what? All right? It's about time to cut your ass out. Just straight like that. Like, I'm not... You're not a truthful person. And... Like, I just... I, I don't have... I don't have you to do. Aquarius just does not have you to do. That is why Aquarius took them fucking swords out of her heart. Or that's why Aquarius... He took the swords out of his heart. Okay? He does not have you to do. At all. Okay, so you should you should go ahead and figure out something to do with yourself. I feel like you didn't ate enough off my plate. You didn't ate enough off my plate. What more do you want? Go on somewhere. Mm -mm. Not when this not when this cute little not when this cute little strange man is coming over here. You better go on somewhere. I'm I'm trying to listen to what this little ass man got to say. Okay. Yeah, and it's Valentine's Day coming up too. I'm trying to see what this little ass man talking about. You better go on some way. Please clarify this. Um, new platinum power poom poom card receiver. Okay. What is this? Is this the lover's card in the reverse? Yeah. Give me some more information about it. That mm -hmm, look, she, you, you just like look, okay? Look, this is this is not worth it. Three party, yep. Mm. And they go to Queen of Pentacles again. She said, "Listen, beloved. Listen, Linda. Listen." She about to give you Belinda today because she's like, listen, I don't think you heard me. Just, just in case you didn't hear me the first time, let me tell you the second, bitch. I don't love you anymore, okay? 
This is the lover's card in reverse. He's she, uh, look Aquarius is like, look, I don't know who that other bitch that you be fucking with or who that other nigga is that you been fucking with, but you can go ahead and y'all can stand in front of the eternal flames of fucking hell and I don't give a fuck what y'all do, okay? Take you and your little fucking witch, whoever the fuck it is that you fucking, and it, you think it's so much better than me, go ahead and take the bitch, okay? And y'all can go ahead and skip right the fuck on off into the darkness because I don't give a fuck and I don't subscribe to the situation no motherfucker more, okay, bitch? Okay? You're a karmic piece of shit from hell and you need to go on fuck on somewhere about yourself, okay? All right? So this is the um ace of um the ace of cups. Mhm. Mm <coughs> the ace of cups in the reverse. Okay? So I forget what, what hold on what what's this called the fountain of what? What's her name? Oh, what's her name the fountain of what's her name? I'm forgetting shit. I'm forgetting. What's the bitch name? Oh, oh, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry, y'all. Because now, now I got to see what the fuck the lady name is. What is the lady name? What is the lady name now? What is the lady name? What's that bitch name? Aphrodite. The Lake of Aphrodite. Okay? Aphrodite. So, listen. The Lake of Aphrodite said you can kiss her ass and like whole time she not even stunting your little weak ass real life because there's somebody else in the background, you know, that's coming on up to the goddamn little fountain that's trying to see what's popping on with Aquarius. So Aquarius is not even too much like stunting on you at all. Like you can like really kiss Aphrodite's black ass straight like that, like motherfucker. You was trying to have a motherfucker in a third party situation. And by the time a person realized what they got they self into, like the whole foundation was already built. Like you've already built that foundation with someone else. So it's like, don't try to bring me in the middle of a situation where it ain't even nothing to work on because you already have an established situation with somebody else. And I'm a queen. Like I'm not, I'm not no third of nobody situation ever. Nor have I ever been, nor will I ever be. So, it's just like, you got me like 50 shades of gray fucked up right now. And, like, yeah, straight like that. Like, straight like that. Alright, so let's clarify this, uh, oh, see, no, we're not doing it. Spirit, let's clarify this, uh, strange love card for Aquarius. Then we won't get up out of here. Aquarius got new love coming. I love it. And it's going to come in the strangest form. Spirit, please give the sign of Aquarius guidance and love. So in regards to the strange love, I feel like you have to turn your back on this king of uh this king of wands energy. You really do because these type of people they really don't have your long term investment in mind. They really don't want to be with you for the long haul, you know. And these are the type of people that you really need to stop giving your energy to. Um. This is the Six of Pentacles, all right? These are situations that you really shouldn't be giving yourself to. And, and, and you can't continue to give yourself charitably to something that don't give back to you. But at the same time, don't give yourself to a situation that you're looking for something back from. But at the same time, it should be a level of respect. It should be a level of respect. And it should be balanced. 
you know, and you shouldn't be with somebody that wants to give to you and give charitably to all of these other people. Then come back and look at you as if you're the burden when you're the only person that they should honestly be given to. You are being aided out of this situation. You understand? It's like you don't have to be so guarded anymore. You know, you being guarded and not opening up yourself to receive blessings from other people. So I feel like you need to step from behind that barrier that you've created for yourself so that you can meet other people and truly find happiness and sunshine in your life. All right, Aquarius. So this has been your reading. All right. Make sure that you know 